Hello and welcome back to Space Engineers. There was no episode last week because I had audio issues. The audio was corrupted. It was bad. It was it, it hurt my brain power. And I only have so much time to do videos, unfortunately. But anyway, nothing really much happened. I mean, we tested. Um, we built. I built a couple small little light, uh, small grid drones and attacked the resource station out there. Uh, it, that was a terrible, terrible failure. I've come to the conclusion that maybe. Uh, resource uh, small grids aren't exactly the best thing to attack uh, stations with like 15 turrets on it I mean who would have thought I'm sure anyway also there was like a random tower that was sitting out there that I captured and ground down we got a bunch of ice now I also removed build Bob I got rid of build Bob Bobby the build up because I don't know I just didn't I just it kind of felt like it took away from the game a little bit um, yeah, I, I got rid of him. I didn't like it. And what else did I do? I got rid of the shields again. You know, kind of feels anti-space engine. My insensitivity is turned way too high right now. Uh, yeah, that'll do for now. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, and I added space got real because I kind of feel like the nighttime should be dark. I mean, we don't have much lights into, so this shouldn't. <laughs> really shouldn't be bright so th we're gonna play with this for a while though that's pretty bright over this hill why are you so bright is the sun coming I don't know it looks like there's a green smoke over there anyway going back down here now today what I thought we'd do is we need to build also Bob's been stealing tires again bad Bob stops yeah more like he, he has stopped stealing tires oh there we go things are spawning yay That's you're not coming towards me though? No, good. Yeah, because things haven't been spawning. And I added a new one, well, maybe not new, that's like S, whatever, whatever spawns that. Asset operations. Though I'm pretty sure the Ember Monarch, maybe. It's part of. I don't know, whatever. Things are spawning. It's good times. Um, what else was I going to say? What are we doing? I said. <coughs> oh, die time, Smokey. That's not good. Okay, so what I want to do is I need to build uh, a welding ship. Slash grinding ship now. I'm thinking I'm going to build an oldie. Um, we got like this here program where, uh, why don't I just type in here projector? There we go. Also, I need to turn the mouse sensitivity up. Okay, let's see. Um, what did I call it? I have an old, old uh, ship that I was using. I don't think it's that old. That's my build Bob grinding system, which I'm not going to be using anymore because I don't have Bob. There's my Bugs Buggy that I built a long time ago, just for fun. I don't think I did that in the video. There's my Digging Tron. I've had this one for ages, Diggatron. Uh, where is... Uh, it's not El Grabby, because that's to grab things when I was trying to do scavenge only survival, which I got bored of pretty quickly, if I'm to be honest. Uh, Grindy Boy, here he is. So we got Grindy Boy, right? I'm thinking uh, we're gonna rebuild Grindy Boy. Uh, let's see, can we go like that? Uh, is that fine? Yeah, so this is Grindy Boy. He has lots of thrust up and down. I think he had four, was it four large thrusters going up? Yeah, four large thrusters going up. Uh, two big ones going forward. And only two, four small ones? Oh no, there's a whole bunch of small ones on top. <laughs> I can't even remember what this guy looks like. So I want to build this guy, and I'm thinking what we'll do is we'll build him, and then I'll take out these grinding uh, things for one, and I'll make uh, welders. Welders, yeah. So we can use him as a welding ship as well. I think everything should be connected up. I'm pretty sure it was a most, uh, mostly or an all vanilla design. Um, I can't get up on it because I don't have a jetpack, yeah. But before we build that, this awesome, awesome device, we need to build a welding wall thing. So what I'm thinking is, how do I want to do this? Okay, so maybe, hmm, 
Okay, maybe. Why well, well, have I got everything on heavy? Oh, everything's on heavy because I was building the drones. I built the drones out of heavy armor and they were still useless. I kind of sort of subconsciously knew they were useless types. Oh, yeah, that's right. I got that type mod on. Um, I also, uh, pistons. I want pistons because I'm going to do pistons. I also going to need conveyors because I'm going to need conveyors. Um, what else are we going to need? Uh, welders. Water, yep, yeah, boom. Okay, you can go here. That should be fine. Okay, so I just completely forgot what I was talking about. Yeah, stuff and things. <laughs> Alright, so to build this thing, what I'm thinking is hmm, I kind of want a large. Nope, I didn't mean to jump and place that. Okay, this could. That can go. Okay, can I? I can't get up on that roof. Where is my little shuttle thing that I use over here he is okay I'm gonna need you uh, turn you on on lock let's go what have you got like in 50 odd minutes of battery power that's cool uh, I just need to get up here for now just we're gonna land you like that perfect okay you need to go hopefully I have enough inventory I don't okay Hmm. I don't have Bob to pick all this stuff up. Uh, do I have... I have somewhere. Do I not have somewhere? I don't have an interface thing up here. Of course I don't have... Oh, I got this though. That worked! Yeah, I don't have an interface terminal up here. I should probably put one up here. Though I'm not really up here that often. But I am going to be building up here. So... I don't know. It is what it is. 60 blocks? 60 blocks probably won't be enough to do this. But that's what we're going to do. Alright. Ow. And now my thing's up there. It's alright. <laughs> There's a ladder on the other side. I didn't use this ladder because that top piece up there, sometimes, most of the time, 90% of the time, knocks me off. That's terrible. Alright, so let's go. Let's back to this. We want to build... Well, I want to build... Um, some sort of welding room. Now, th this ship's about this big. So what I'm thinking is... We have to make the thing at least uh, can we uh, I should probably use that ship that I built that I've left up on the roof yeah I should probably do that uh, one sec alright well this should make life a lot easier uh, there we go assuming the placing thing works uh, how do I do this again control G excellent okay so thinking you're not gonna let me do it. There we go. I'm thinking we gotta go like this size. Probably will actually come in one. All right. So we'll have the welding arm come down here. Now that means the piston. So the welders are about that high, right? They're about two blocks high, if I remember correctly. Um, weld. Yeah, that's, that was right. Welder, where are you? Here, boom. Put you on that spot. Uh, we'll put a piston on this spot. And I think I have, yeah, I got the conveyor tubes down there, so. Alright, so the welders are going to be, yeah, too high. Plus the pistons are going to be too high. Now, I don't mind these being down one, so... Pistons are going to be up this high. Okay. Well, the piston. I'm only going to have one piston. How wide is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Excellent. So four. One, two, three. Like that. And then we can put our piston like that. And then we can convey uh, this way. Not convey. Uh, wall place. We're just going to make it a box for now. Like that. Oh, I forgot. There's no. I'll be careful going down with this thing. I. Oh, I don't have interior plates. It's fine. It's fine. All right. So I want to put uh, a welder like that, and then I kind of want to like cross pattern them. If you know what I mean. So like they'll be like there. Then it'll be like a conveyor junction connecting it all up. Probably will only need. Uh, so we go like that. We 
you can get one, one, two there, two there, yeah, so there'll probably be nine, yeah, nine, yeah, nine, so what we'll do is we'll have three in a row here, no, less than nine, so we'll have three in a row, so like, one there, two, and three, and then we'll offset it and have one and two on it, on the, on the sides, and theoretically that should, uh, make it, uh, do what I want it to do, theoretically. Um, again, I, I've, well, not again, I, I've never actually done this before. <laughs> I've, I've been quite reliant upon Bob or just, you know, welding ships. So what I need to do is I need some interior, interior plates. We've got plenty of them. We can have 23. Maybe we can have a bit more than 23. What do you think? Yep, 223. Okay. Also, steel. Give me some of those. Thank you. All right. Now we can kind of finish this off and get a good idea of how we're going to have this work. Control G. All right. So we're going to need you. I'm thinking we'll have one pipe. Then we'll have this. Okay, and then we go back to the pipes, and we need a T-pipe. Uh, did that just land right next to me? Oh, it's one of the annoying ball ones. Uh, um, so we go like that, and then I'm going to need a curvy boy. Curvy boy. And then let's just go with... Excuse me. I am trying to do a video. Oop, that's not the button I want to do. Can you please run away or stop? Okay. Ha ha ha. Oh, that wasn't the button. Give me the button. You're annoying me. I hate this one, by the way. Yeah, I'm pressing the button. I want to. Okay. Got badger gloves. I already got badger gloves. Did you have anything good in you after all of that? Um, eh. Some rations and some carrots and some money. You're a disappointment. I'm just going to leave you there. I'm offended by your presence. Um, <laughs> yeah, so maybe we can get on with what we're doing. We can probably do it from the bottom here without getting the ship. So we go like that, and then I'm thinking. Oh. Uh, Okay, so if we do it that way, bam, then we'll have another one there. Maybe we should have another row of three on the inside there. I'm thinking that'll be the way to go. Yeah, that's going to be the way to go. All right, so I'm going to place down the framework, and then when we come back, we will do a, I guess we'll do a welding thingy. We've got to weld it all up. All right, see you in a sec. Well, I should have the basics all placed, except for that. that that's got to go that little L shape there. Don't worry about that. But yeah, I think I've got the basics all placed as it becomes really dark. Um, I'm thinking what we might do is we might just weld up. I want to see. I want to see if I can just weld up um, the conveyor chips, the piston, and then weld up one welder. And then have everything just kind of weld itself. Maybe? I don't know. I wonder if that would even be possible. So, what I need to do is dump all that. I need, give me 10 of those. Give me a piston. And give me a welder, which I don't have. So, bam. So, that should be all that. I might need more than 10 of these, actually. You know what? Here, just, just on the safe side, give me another 10. Okay, so... We weld all of that up. This is our little conveyor tube. I may change it eventually. I may swap it out so I can put like another turret on top. I don't know how good of an idea that is. It's probably a terrible idea, but I'm going to do it anyway. Um, let's see. So we've got our pistons here. This is like the sub layer, the maintenance area. You can't really see anything because it's pitch. Well, not only is it pitch black, but also um, all the things being unwelded does kind of make it a bit difficult to see everything and I am aware of that 
I did not want to world up that piece. I want those pits back, please, sir. Thank you. Give me, there we go. Perfect. Back to normal. Okay, so we got to world that up. I also need to... Something else something. I don't remember what it was. Completely and utterly just completely... Did I just... No. This one. You need a large steel too because I put it in here. Can I, hey, give me that. Well, that. Well, that. God damn it. It's always the way. Uh, give me these. Come over here. Well, that. There we go. Well, that. Alrighty. Can I access the control panel? Alright, I can't really access the control panel. Okay, so. Now, to see if this will actually weld everything up. It's a 50-50 uh, chance that this will work. I'm not too sure. Uh, I guess we'll, we'll see. Uh, and if it does, well, I guess we can do a little time-lapse video and see how much we can get done with the welders. Alrighty, so let's begin this process um, by going here. We go welder, the one welder we got, turn on. Okay, you're going to weld up everything around you, yes, excellent, okay, this may actually work, and then now we can turn on all the other welders, and let the welding fun begin, okay, Your health is low. I know my health is low, yes, weld yourselves up my preciouses, ha 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 ha, all right, let's get this place welded. Alright, well, it should theoretically be functional. I've welded out this, welded out, I've painted out this little warning dangerous area. I've kind of feel like the whole thing is going to be a dangerous area. Um, I've got this little thing here. This comes out of the projector. It's so I can, like, attach the projector to, you know, the blocks and that nice and easily. It's down low. It's panels, so you can just step over it by walking. It worked. That was totally planned. Not at all a, um... 
accident, just full on plan. But before we do anything, all right, I need to test. Uh, I need to test something. I need to make sure that this piston has enough strength to lower. Well, we'll have enough strength to lower, but to raise. Um, Okay, I'm going to guess it has connected to these blocks on the corner here, because that would actually make sense, and I knew that was going to be an issue, and I just completely forgot about it. <laughs> Good work, Smokey. You did a dumb. It's alright, Smokey. Smokey, you always do a dumb. Don't you talk to me about being dumb. Alright, so let's just, we'll get rid of you. Uh, we'll get rid of this one. Alright, and then we'll get rid of this one, and this one. Yeah, it's it's starting to loosen up. We c I heard it. Get rid of that one and that one. Okay, and then shh, no clanging. Nobody likes a clanger. All right, let's do that. I'll fix these up in a minute. I'll probably turn this all into a um, blaster armor, blast armor, blast yeah armor bla blast armor blocks or whatever, just to make it look nice. Um, that didn't sound good. It's fine. Everything's fine. We never ever have problems here at Smoky Land. Right, there we go, should be fine. Okay, well that went all the way down? Didn't really intend for you to go all the way down. How did you go through this? There is a glass panels. How did you... Okay. <laughs> Alrighty, alright, let's have a look. Uh, piston, piston, wall to wall to piston. What are you currently at? 7.2. So maybe let's go to, we'll say 6.5. Yeah, I feel like 6.5. See, there's like, see how there's glass? I put glass there so I wouldn't world blocks, like, it wouldn't try to world a block that was inside the welders. Um, at least that was my theory. Uh, but on the plus side, that's also not welded up. Who said you could be unwelded? I didn't say you could be unwelded. Alright. That's just rude. Absolutely rude. Do I have enough to actually fix this problem? Did I grind these down somehow? I mean... I am a bit silly. Mm, no, I don't think I... I guess that was the loud bang I heard before. Anyway, <laughs> moving on. Okay, so on the plus side, uh, it can lift it up and down. That is the benefit. That is a big benefit. Now, for the real test. All right, we want to. Can I just connect these? Um, I need to connect you somewhere. Let's connect you back here. I feel like. And. Is that right? Are you right? I don't know. I can't tell. I think I need to be one more on top. Now, there is a better way to do this with... There we go. That's connected. Um, is that connected properly, though? Is that going to be an issue? Probably. I was just thinking that it may actually cause a bit of an issue being connected there, because the first one to be welded up would be higher than the rest of it, which is fine. It's actually fine. I've got an idea. I can fix this. All right, so we're gonna go bam, and will that work there? If I can get it to place, yep. All right, so we can do that. Now we gotta set the piston speed. Actually, we should probably set that pretty slow. Well, the piston speed. Um, let's set it to 0.2. Okay. All right, let's just we'll bring this down. Right. Hopefully that's slow enough to weld everything up. Oh god damn it, I just realized. This is more of a this is a fault with uh the ship design than it is a fault with eh. Yeah, this is a fault with the ship design. <laughs> I need to make it so that it'll weld something lower first. Um What will we make something lower? So because it won't weld that, it won't weld that block until it's all the way up, and then it probably miss everything else. Maybe we can just make it kind of move. come come over here, come here. All right, and then 
we go like that and like that that may work may not work we'll see all right that's the whole point of tests isn't it is it not okay let's go here groups we got welders on the thing there we go toggle you on all righty so let's see if this will work it's gonna hit that i wonder if it'll freak out and just go through it like it did these ones Okay, well, I can live with it being like that. Pillow welders on reverse. It's fine, it's all fine. These sounds are fine. Nothing wrong with these sounds at all. It's fine. It's fine. It's all fine. It's all fine. Oh, I know what this is. This is not the pistons. This is the ship. Control panel. Crosses. Damn it, it's so noisy! There we go. <laughs> For some reason when the thrusters are on, it this thing here clangs the hell out, so um I'll, I'll probably fix that by pulling this out of the ground. I liked it in the ground, it's like really nice and secure, but it bangs around like crazy. Maybe I'll just get rid of the uh I'll probably just get rid of the edge layer and then it'll have a gap and it can wobble and freely and not freak out. It's on a piston. Ah, uh, rotor, sorry. Alright, so. How do we go? We miss the thruster here. Blocks aren't welded up. Okay, so. That's a little bit of a problem. Again, this is. I think. I feel like this is more of a design with. A design? A design flaw with the. Um, uh, uh, what do you call it? A uh, design flaw with the um, ship sort of it's not really designed to be built in a printer like this so right, we just go down like that okay that's fine here we go I do have the range turned up on those on the pistons on the welders because I just think the range is stupid but there we go I think that actually printed that rather successfully <laughs> I mean all things considered that is all right so let's disconnect this bad boy That was stupid. Let's disconnect this bad boy with the thrusters turned on. Uh, why are one of the thrusters off? There we go. Okay, they're all on now. What's going on? I am confused as to why you're not flying. Why aren't you flying? What? Oh. They're all off. I do that. I knew that. I was just testing you guys. I was just seeing if you knew. Is low. Yeah, I know. My health is low. It's at 37. It's fine. Okay. Well, that worked pretty well. Um, we got one grinding ship out. Now, I could just constantly change over um, things, like the grinders into holders. Or, what I can do is we can print another one. So, let's print another one. I think I have enough resources. I should. Alright, let's do this. Put that there. Okay. Let's reverse the pistons. Make sure they're all turned off. Yep, they're turned off. Excellent. But it probably wouldn't matter if they were turned on anyway, because they can only weld uh, what it can reach. Alright. Uh, it's going to flip out again because of thrusters. It's fine. We've got to take a blueprint with thrusters turned off. I'll get to that. All right, let's turn this on, and then let's back this up. Yep, there goes the noise. I gotta fix that. Right, let's just. Uh
rid of this real quick. God, that is so noisy. Plank, there's no reason for you to be doing this, alright? You're only doing this to be a dick. If we know it. We all know it. You're not fooling anyone. You're just doing this to be a pain in the butt and ruin everyone's life. I also need to get a better grinder. I don't know how loud this is in the video, but I know in my head it is very loud. Um, yeah. Okay, let's just here, look. Look. Here. Here. Look, yay. Now this could be easily solved if I just don't have um, the thrusters turned on when I build, when I take blueprints. But I'm going to be honest, that's not something I'm going to remember to do. There you go. Noise is gone. New noise is here. That's fine. Okay, there we go. Pretty good. Another one printed. Another successful day. Let's just grind that off. Okay, perfect. Now let's just move you out. Um, can I just see this way? Thanks. Excellent. There we go. We now have two ships. Um, I feel like I probably should put more uh, thrusters on the br on the braking on this thing, especially considering I've got like freaking two large go thrusters. Um, okay, let's get rid of these guys. The good thing about the welder and the grinder is they actually take the same resources, if I'm not mistaken, on small grids anyway. Um, so that's always a benefit. It can make life so much simpler. Right, let's put you there, and we'll put you there. There we go. We now have a weldy ship, and that should allow me to weld up the rest of that base. Alrighty, well, I would call that a pretty successful day. 
There's a few and far in between these days. So we go to our little printing thing. It works pretty well. It was good. The welding ship works pretty well. Now the last thing to do before we wrap up today is to test the grinding ship on the offensive object. So let's grind this bad boy down. Let's see how we go. Granted it's only a small grid, but hey, let's see how we go. Yeah, well we're good in there. It's grinding it down pretty quickly. And it exploded everything everywhere, but it's just fine. Whoa, whoa. Hello. Okay. Well, that happened. But yeah. So overall, quite a successful day. This is also why I have I just hit the screen. Thank God we're inside a cockpit. This is also why. <laughs> what are you doing? Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Why? Why were you doing that? This is why I have the two large... No, wait, I don't have two large thrusters holding me. Okay, I don't, never mind. Um, yeah, anyway. I was going to say, this is why I have the two large thrusters facing forward, but I don't have them facing forward, they're facing backwards. Anyway, it doesn't matter. But yeah, I'm going to call that a pretty successful uh, day. We've got ourselves a winding ship, a welding ship, and a new printing bay, which is pretty good, pretty convenient, works really well. Oh, I like it. Did I forget to weld up that? No, I didn't. No one saw that. You didn't see anything. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that other fun stuff. And as always, have a good one. And I'll see you all next time. Bye. Okay, now. Got to get a way to charge these bad boys. Hmm. Okay, that's a priority.